Professor Abloy talked to engineer Jürgen Pell about how white architecture took advantage of BIM in the design of the groundbreaking Karolinska Solna Hospital in the center of Stockholm. Graduated as a construction engineer just because we want to be a part of, of drawing the buildings or specify what it should be. It's a big project that won't happen again probably in, in decades. And the program is 330,000 square meters hospital building in the built city environment. So it's a really tough chance to get the hospital squeezed in. So it was one of the biggest BIM models in the world that we have actually had 20 BIM models. 120 architects and engineers at the same time for one office. It's only drawing for this project. We had to use BIM. Otherwise, we, re we soon realized that it wasn't possible to deliver on time. Suppliers usually have their objects, but for us, it's uh, usually too detailed. We take it and look at it, and then we take the information that we need, the measurement and the placement and the, uh, the regulations behind it, or for the builder to, to know what the importance of the function. Let's say for a door closer or a door automation. I've been working with all the doors, and it's somewhere around 12,000 doors in the hospital. And probably I have made some adjustments on every door, one time at least. For regulations in the hospital, it's a lot about hygiene, logistics. Hygiene is for keeping the patients safe, of course. So different areas in the hospital have different compliances, and you can quite easily see that in the public areas. There's a lot of glass, a lot of security boundaries and fire boundaries. And the automation there is for keeping the doors open and shut in different times of the day. We have people working to keep track of all those regulations and certification systems that the customer want to have. And also for, for us in the future to know that this hospital is healthy and we know all the products. And we have taken responsibility for, for showing people that it's achievable to build in this way. That responsibility was shared by Asa Abloy, who assisted White Architecture with the specification of entrance systems throughout the hospital. You can find out more at entry.asaabloyentrance.com. <laughs>